Hi, this video is for my college work. For this video, I'll be do I'll be going over an old gem of Great Britain. If that is, if you've actually heard of it, great. You you've heard of it, so you know what I'm talking about. I thought, well, you're about to be seeing it now. The old gem in question is a sitcom by the name of The Last of the Summer Wine. <laughs> the Last of the Summer Wine was a sitcom that lasted from 1973 to 2010. When it was cancelled for unknown reasons, it broadcast on BBC One and it broadcast on around summer time at on Sunday evenings. I know because I actually I actually really enjoyed watching it. Uh, the show was focused on three elderly, elderly gentlemen, all of which had youthful antics. I actually have had some clips of Last of the Summer Wine. Two from Elegy for Fallen Wellies. And one from just a small funeral. I've chosen these episodes because they deal with a heavy blow to the series, the death of Compo, who was betrayed by Belowen, and who had been actually been on the show for or a since its start, along with um, Norman Clegg, who was betrayed by betrayed by, by Peter Salis. He pa passed away a eve around 1999-2000, which was around the time they, they also did, did the episodes on Compo's death. The first clip is the general group reacting to the news of Compo's death when it's broken with them. Why weren't we at the pub? And we're normally at the pub. Why didn't he want to go to the pub? He said he was busy. Doing what? Dying. The death of Wolf Bellowen had been a major impact with the programme's cast, especially Peter Salas, who, as I said before, portrayed Norman Clegg. Or who, as he was referred to as Cleggy. Who and throughout the episode, Cleggy is shown struggling to say goodbye to Compo, who ha had told no one of his unwell state. They it wasn't even said on what his illness was, whether it was cancer, some, something else, something he was lethal. The um the following clip is. It is of Truly, another gentleman, whose name actually escapes me right now, but he, his surname was True Love, and he was a former police officer, and he's another main character, and he's showing Gavin Clegg and the, uh, the other characters to give Colton Poe a prop goodbye in the form of white paint overalls on a hillside. Come on, then, in you get. <laughs> Where are we going? You wanted to say goodbye to Compo. Come on, then. Well, come on, then. Let's go say goodbye to Compo. The gesture that is seen in the previous clip is both heartwarming and saddening, as this is not just a tribute to the character but to the actor as well, as they are saying, that is, as it is their way of saying goodbye to a friend they have had for so long. However, true to comedy's nature, not even a sad event cannot be made funny. Uh, 
as you're about to see in the third and final clip where it is showing Combo's funeral and they are carrying his casket out of the church. Trust me, you'll see what I this is a new using in, in a bit. <laughs> said a small funeral. I thought it would be. We thought you'd like another wander through the hills, old son. Solid opinion. This is, and this is just my opinion. It's not yours. It's just mine. The Last of Someone was a brilliant program, and it brought out the humour and un that is underlying every situation that is usually ignored, like what well, you stub your toe. Oh, and you're in so much pain. You know there's a funny side to it, but you choose to ignore it to just to focus on the pain. And perhaps the same goes with every situation. Right now, such as right now, I'm talking to a camera. Yeah, um, the program was one of my favourites and will hold a place in my heart that won't easily be replaced. Over, oh, I, did, I do actually enjoy a lot of comedies, and for some reason they've all gone off somewhere. Or stopped, cancelled, stopped production. But, now. Since this video is actually for my college work, I'm going to be saying this, I will be disabling the comments, so I'm sorry but you can't leave a comment on this, but thank you for watching and hopefully I'll see you another time when I'm actually doing proper videos for my channel. Have a good one.